Hello, this is Jay Rodman. Um, I'm uh, returning to Bard's Tale 3. This time we're going to try to make it further into the catacombs. Uh, now that I realize I have spells to defeat, insanity, poison, and other things. Uh, in fact, let's go ahead and look at the spells I received recently because I haven't yet, so I don't actually know what spells I have. So my magician first, Stubby. Uh, I'm going to go down the spell list. Starflare I've been using. Okay, so my new spells are these two. SPTO is Spectre Touch. That's a long range, single target uh, damage spell. Um, it does some sort of, it's like a, a negative life energy kind of thing. And Dragon Breath, which is a uh, slightly stronger group affecting spell than star flare which I had before star flare I think goes out 40 feet which is makes it like a longest reaching group spell for a while so I, I think that one's actually gonna get used a lot dragon breath is a little more damage costs a few more spell points meanwhile my conjurer I, oop no, I'm not trying to cast a spell I want to look at the spells the conjurer Tenuviel has uh, also two new spells. Um, Instant Wolf, which is a conjuring spell which would be useful if I had fewer than seven party members, but since I do, it's pretty useless. And um, FLRE, which is Flesh Restore, which is that spell that was should have been saving my bacon, but I had kind of forgot that I had it and everything that it did. Okay, so to start off, we're going to cast some long-lasting spells. Uh, the, lo the Mystic Shield, the armor improvement, and Lesser Revelation. I'm actually going to cast a light spell this time, just for the heck of it. And of course, uh, the compass spell. Now I'm going to go to the bar. Drink some beer. And get my bard song going. Now everyone has a reasonable armor class. I'm gonna use my new dragon breath on these these enemies. Utterly destroying them. the bard song to the rhyme of duo time so that while I'm on my way to the dungeon I'll be regenerating hit points at this point I'm no longer that interested in Wilderness fights. They're not bad, exactly, but they take time. Um, they give less experience than I'm likely to get in the dungeon. definitely will not give me any equipment upgrades, which at this point, I'm kind of do a lot of them. I'm actually way behind in my healing, I kind of forgot about that, which is what I'm doing now.
later, uh, we, there are some stronger healing spells. Which could heal the whole party more or less at once. Always the slightly cheaty way to heal, which is go into a fight with ourselves. Defend, 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 cast the bring around ballad. Everyone get some heals. We're gonna keep fighting. And I think that the bring around ballad stacks. So that round we got four hit points back. This round we'll get six. And now we're full. I mean, I don't know. Maybe I should call it... Maybe... Like, it felt to me like cheating when I first learned about it, but they kept the mechanic through three games. They had to have known it was there. Uh, it got implemented incorrectly in some versions and then brought back again when recoded, so I'm pretty sure it's intentional, but it does feel a little odd. cuts out the sound. And so this time I'm in the dungeon again. I'm gonna head just east. Um, this is um, a thing where random monsters can offer to join your party, and if you have space for them, they would enter your party and fight for you. Typically, they're much weaker than your party members though, so I don't ever say yes. And at this point I'm looking for easy equipment um, improvements. So fighting one and one enemy can carry just as much uh, chance for items as a group of enemies. So fighting one enemy is kind of desirable to me right now. do some sort of breath attack. I don't remember for sure. didn't do any breath attacks now. It did hit me kind of hard. Let's see if my rogue... Oh, my rogue can't find anything. Yeah, so Trap Zap it is. It's a nice conjurer spell. Don't leave home without it. In Bard's Tale 1, the rogues were so... I, I may have mentioned the rogues were not very um, essential, and Trap Zap was just how I opened every single chest. Now 
Spell Creepers, well, I think they do something special, but I don't remember. I think they're kind of weak, but do something special occasionally. But, oh, and look, we're hitting for three hits. That's oh, because the Rhyme of Dua time is still going. Right, which increases our damage output, but probably smarter is to use the Armor Class song. Incidentally, I changed the symbol for silence. I couldn't find a good one, but I think I wouldn't even want the fields for other things. I may change my mind again later. Uh, this room, I think, is empty. Except for this Zephyr Lord. I guess. And he's going to summon wolves. While he's summoning those wolves, I'm just going to have my bard try to, I mean, my rogue try to sneak up and kill him. Maybe it'll work. Maybe it won't. Those wolves have so many hit points. Oh my goodness. Yeah, look at it. I just hit it for like 50 or so. It's still, it's still swinging. Sixty. Eighty, maybe ninety. Okay, less than a hundred forty. Shitty rogue. Wish you'd find any spell or any traps. I guess it's not that big a deal. Not yet. I guess I can... Do I have a detection spell yet? I think I don't. Locate traps is like level one sorcerer spell. Ooh, a crazy cloud. Let's see if I can disarm it. Crazy cloud. I set off a crazy cloud. Oh, that's annoying. I wonder if like it's capitalization sensitive or something. Or a bug. I'm really wrong about how traps work. In the DOS version and the Amiga version, traps barely work, so I may have misunderstood the mechanics.
think I've been all throughout this first section. I could, and this door. Zoom in. This door gatekeeps to basically the rest. Five phantoms and two blood fiends. So I'm going to have everyone try to stab the blood fiends who are ten feet away. But have Stubby use Dragon Breath on the phantoms. Killed one. Not as much as I was hoping for. And my hand to hand specialists are not making much progress against these blood fiends. One's down. Star flare on the phantoms, yes. Managed to get a blood fiend down. The phantoms are going down much more easily. One left. Attack a blood fiend, blood fiend, monk on the phantom, bard on the blood fiend. Everyone else is going to do nothing. Blood Fiend is down. One Phantom remains. I could swear I'm typing these correctly. I don't know, maybe there's just more of a risk than I realize. And Stubby has 12 hit points. Um, now, have there been any items which I didn't notice as picking up? Other 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 items of my shield. <laughs> uh, so Kriznak is armor class four, and equipping this would be armor class three. So that makes me think this newly discovered item is a buckler. We'll let our rogue try.
that happens when you step through a door like into this area um, well no I'm actually gonna use a bard song bard bring around ballad Foul stalkers have a breath weapon. This is not nice. There's a weird pause after you use the trap zap to it says you've disarmed it and it waits for you to press space or something. Okay, so I have a mithril plate mail. That is a pretty good upgrade. I trade that over to Lady Oak and Shields. something there. Well, I guess not always. This is going to be a harder fight. Uh, I'm going to start with a bring around ballad. Both mages are going to cast group spells. Oh, I guess War Strike doesn't go 30 feet. That is a shame. Now, they were at 30 feet, and then in one round they went to 10 feet, so I guess um, whatever curs they are, miasmal curs, I guess they're fast.
so... Faster way to search for these. Annotation. Okay. So when they say the priests seek another word, um, the priests let me to the temple, invited me to speak a word. So maybe there's another one. first. I don't they're both dangerous as far as I can tell, but the fat and the fast has done more significant damage to me recently. Items in the game that let you recover spell points. Or rather, when you use them up and use them up permanently, you get spell points back. So far, I found zero of them. waiting for mage point, spell points to refill. It's not going to do that. So if, um, if we don't start getting some harmonic gems, then what I'm going to do is uh, simply go off camera to wait for the mage, mage points to refill. I guess I'm mindlessly attacking when they're not in range, so... I have to think one enemy. Oh, that's easy. I don't care. I'm going to just attack it. He's kind of kicking my ass.
I'm going to go back to the service now. And regain my spell points. Where am I? Oh, that's where I am. One reason for to uh, care about a better light source is you can see more. And once you can see more, it's harder to get confused about what you're seeing. What is a nefast? I do wonder. They don't seem friendly. I wonder if we've encountered all of these things before. Because, you know, I don't know what a nefast is. How do they know? Any items? Any items? Nope. song I meant to sing. I meant to sing Rhyme of Duo Time. There we go. Okay. Um, before I sign off, let's go check how we're doing on experience levels. spell points and then